Garden State Comic Fest, July 25th and 26th at the Men in Sports Arena, Morristown, New Jersey. <laughs> Welcome to Garden State Comic Fest. Morristown, New Jersey. <laughs> welcome to Morristown. One of us is saying welcome to Morristown. Okay. Welcome to Morristown Comic Fest. Ah, uh, what would a comic book convention be without comic books? It would just be a convention. Lone Punisher here. Cantina Black Widow. They call me Slinger. Scarlet Witch. <laughs> Woohoo! Sheriff Steve Rogers, Captain America. Here we are at historic Marstown, New Jersey, Garden State Comic Fest with the one and only Ming Chen from Comic Book Men. And as I hear, there's a new season of Brew? Uh, yes, there is. We'll be back October 18th. So as, as soon as I'm done uh, completing the railroads, we'll be, we'll, you can watch, you can, that I'll be going back to the show. And, and you can watch it on October 18th. <laughs> Daddy has no idea of oh. any historical perspective. That was quite funny. <laughs> All right. Yeah, you get back to work. <laughs> Gorilla Karat. You can't match the power and intelligence of Gorilla Karat. No arguments there. <laughs> It's actually Ruby Renexo! <laughs> Welcome to Garden State Comic Fest, Morristown, New Jersey! Lift the thing up, put the paper under it, put it back down, one sec. Stop ruining my work. We are here at Menon Arena in Morristown, and it is quite a fun show. They've got a little bit of everything going on. Hi, Hi Deadpool. How's it going? See what I mean? My name is Russell. How can I assist you today? Hey, where's that old man you hang out with? I don't know. I'm trying to get my last badge. Oh, there's that Asner. I don't get it, man. <laughs> Enjoying the show? Yeah. What do you think of this artist over here? He's all right. And here we are back with old school Craig what's, Blake. What's good? Always trust the word of someone who believes in ultraviolence. Seriously, because you never know what they're going to inflict upon you later. So, thanks for the support. Please don't like maim me outside of here. You could use a bit of ultraviolence, sir. Yeah. 
What do you want to take about? Mike McCone, how are you? I'm very well. I'm very well. How are you? Good. What's going on today? Um, not much. Not much. It's kind of, it's a Sunday, so uh, it's a little more relaxed than yesterday. But, uh, I see you're working on something. I am. I'm going to. Well, I don't want to hold it up because the paint will run. No, that's fine. It's a Thor for a friend of a friend. Beautiful. I get love my, it. Get my Joe Cuba on. <laughs> how do you like Morristown? Um, I've only was, I've only seen the convention center and the McDonald's. Oh. So, so far, so good. Got to make but, uh, it to downtown. It's really? Very historic. Lots of Irish pubs. Uh, well, actually, we went to the Committed Pig yesterday, which was very good. Awesome. But I understand there's um, there are a few uh, APS. So uh, hopefully, check it out before I leave. You got it. And thanks again. Thank you. See ya. Very nice guys. But uh, DC, DC. DC, 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 DC. Marvel. You don't mind, right? Here we are with the legendary Greg Hildebrandt. Sarah, this is an honor to finally meet you. How are you doing? I'm doing well, thank you. And what you got going on right here? Uh, Harley and the Joker, a painting that I did specifically to be at this show with. And we can see that the painting just sold, even though I'm not finished with it yet, but I am going to take it home and finish it. Well, it'll take very, about two more days. Very, so very let's... nice. You are, uh, your artwork has touched millions. I mean, obviously the Star Wars poster, uh, Lord of the Rings. Um, what would you say has been some of your favorite projects over the years to work on? Every one of them. But I mean, no, right now, um, well, I love doing this kind of thing right here, but uh, for me, I'm turned on to, like I've been doing retro pinups since 1999, and that's really a, a very, very exciting project that I, uh, that I, that I keep at. And I work, I do all the art for the Trans-Siberian Orchestra, which is a fantastic, uh, unique experience for me. Ladies. You can't get him in that room. No, you can't. I gotta take this part from here. Can you chop these two guys' heads off? <laughs> Here we are with the lovely Adana Velez. Hi guys, and how are you? Who do you have with you? I have my hero Sean with me today. He's hi. hanging out with me. Hi Sean. Say hi. Thank you. He's been my little assistant today. Say hi. And what you doing today at Garden State Comic Fest? We're actually here um, spectating and I am actually the judge, the feature judge for the kids cosplay contest. And that's later today? That is later today at 3 p.m. So stop by and come and spectate. We sure will. Thanks, Dan. Well, the legendary Walter Simonson is here somewhere. Ladies, how are you? Hey, how's it going? Enjoying the show? Yes, very much. Could I say you look super? Yes, you can. <laughs> and how about you? Pretty good, thank you. Very nice Batwoman. Thank you. And Amazon, how are you? It's fantastic here. <laughs> Almost like better I'm... than Paradise <laughs> Island. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like I'm standing in a hole. <laughs> oh my... Well, you are very lovely, all of you. Thank you very much. <laughs> Boy, this show has got it all. All of our favorites, including the one and only Bob Camp. Hello. How you doing, sir? I'm good. And what's going on here today? Uh, I'm doing sketches of Rinna Stippy for people. I'm uh, we've got animation cells. We've got prints. Uh, I do song and dance, impersonations, all that crap. I imagine you attract some weird fans over the years. Uh, we do. I, I get. Uh, can you can you do me a quick favor? A lot of real special fans. Can yeah. You, can you please like, start? Look at this weird you, guy. Can you please start drawing my Ren and Stimpy? <laughs> I asked you like three days ago. Please. <laughs> you know what? It's a little thing of money. Oh. A little oh. cashola. A little do oh. re me. I'm oh, sorry. I don't have that. I'm <laughs> oh, sorry. That's okay. Thanks anyway. It's been great talking to you. Get over here, you. What would a Comic-Con be without funny books? 
Hey, I'm Steve from Funny Books, also known as Funny Steve, and this is our store mascot, Mini Books. And my first customer ever from 1992, Ziggy, still with us. He didn't realize when he was our first customer he'd be signing on for life. <laughs> this weekend we're having our annual destroy all sales, 22 hours of absolute price destruction. And this is my own comic book right here, Action Figure Kingdom and Action Zombie Kingdom. And this is Ziggy's comic book, Sidekick. Where's that is piece of artwork you just had? Macho Man Randy Savage, the cream of the crop. Thank you. Funny Ooh, Books yeah. is uh, located in Lake Hiawatha, New Jersey, and we just celebrated our 23rd birthday. Congratulations and see ya. Kevin DiPlacido as Star Lord. Stunning! Right, Dan? Or waste. What do you think, sir? I don't get it, man. <laughs> <laughs> Scott Hanna, how are you? Very good. Um, I'm enjoying the show quite a bit. Uh, I've been doing lots of drawing. I'm working right now on Spider-Man. Um, I'm also teaching classes. I actually had a great young artist come up to me for a portfolio review and she was superb and I was teaching her about some of the next thing, steps she can take in art and learning how to draw. Um, so I'm having a great time and uh, I don't know what else to say. Um, I think that was perfect. You are fantastic. Thank you. Thanks again. <laughs> there we go. It just wouldn't be a Comic-Con without the lovely Danielle Frazetta. Danielle, how you doing? I'm fantastic. You just you keep looking better and better. It's the hair. <laughs> oh, yeah. I don't know what I'm going to do with it. <laughs> Too much. Kim DeMolder, how are you, sir? Um, great to be here. And what's going on with you today? Um, selling prints, doing a little bit of art, doing some sketches. It's been, a, it's actually been a very good show. I've had my eye on your evil Spock for a while. Can you yeah. tell me what that's about? Um, earlier in the year when Leonard Nimoy passed away, there were a lot of people doing tributes to him. And this was basically my response to that. I wanted to get on that too. I grew up watching Star Trek. So Spock was a childhood friend of mine. So yeah, I wanted to get in on that too. Th this was one of my favorite episodes of that original series. I just loved the way Spock looked with a beard. So Absolutely. And uh, Leonard Nimoy was a great man. He was a wonderful man. I, and wish you I, are, I wish I could have had the chance to meet him. I know, me too. Didn't meet him, but you are a phenomenal artist. So Thank thanks you very for talking much. with us. Take care. Uh, great times here at Garden State Comic Fest. And here I am with Gamora, the flying turtle. It's Gamora, the deadliest woman in the universe. And who's this, Captain Lame? I'm Star-Lord. I'm sure you are. And here we are with Poison Ivy. I am Groot. <laughs> <laughs> All right, thank you. There is the legendary Neil Adams artwork. Neil's back there somewhere. <laughs> Oh, God, I love coming to these comic book conventions. Oh, hi. And you're at the Garden State Comic Fest. And you are? And I am Pocahontas, but of course. <laughs> What's your real name and why are you here? Nina, and I'm actually here with Michael Cabernero, and he's got a new show. It's called Comic America. You can watch that on contv.com, so check it out. Thank you, Nina. You are so welcome. Uh, here we are with one of my childhood favorites, co-creator of The Huntress, who I love, Mr. Joe Staten. Yes, Hello? We, yes, we love The Huntress. Yeah. How you doing, sir? Doing okay. 
And what's going on? You enjoying yourself in Morristown? Yes, I'm, I'm, I'm having a good time. It's been a good show. Always yeah. nice to have a local show like this in New Jersey. Yeah, well this one's not far from me, so it's, it's easy driving distance. I'm, I'm pleased with it. Do you have anything you're working on currently? Well, I'm still still drawing Dick Tracy for uh, you know for newspapers for uh, GoComics.com. That's a good place to follow it. And the other thing I'm pushing right now is First Comics. Uh, the new version of First Comics has released a collection of the old E-Man material that uh, is about to go into the stores. It, it ships on the 16th. It'll be in the stores on the 23rd. So. I love your E-Man, and I also loved your Power Girl back. Oh, in the yeah. day. Yes, we, we love Power so, Girl. Yes. Thanks so much. Thank you. You know, this looks all well and good, but you ladies do know that he's a villain? <laughs> I've eaten monkeys bigger than him for breakfast, and I just had a Wonder <laughs> Woman. <laughs> Look at my new lunch. <laughs> good luck. You'll break your teeth. <laughs> oh, yeah. oh, my God. Hey. This is some sweet artwork from Billy Tucci. Hello, Billy. Hello. How you doing? <laughs> Come back. I'm doing all right. How you doing, buddy? Not bad. You enjoying Morristown? Love it. Love it. Uh, please, Dave and Sal, to have me back. We had the best time this weekend. What a fantastic show. Uh, I live on Long Island. Um, I was engaged with Jersey Girl. She was awesome. And uh, just a great, great town. Great people. Great convention. Great convention. I hope to come back. And do you have anything you're working on currently? Yeah, I'm working on the new. It's it's our 20th anniversary for She, my comic book. And I'm working on the 20th anniversary book right now. It'll come out next year. It's going to be a graphic novel, and the book is actually going to take is going to be 20 years removed from the original series. So nice. now my character will be in her mid 40s. She'll be married. She'll have two children, and her past is far in her past, her samurai ways. And uh, some uh, through a few course of actions, it all comes back again. It always does. It always comes back. And a bunch of other projects that, that I'll let the publishers announce it. Thank but you it's gonna so be a big much. Year. Thank you, bud. Good seeing you guys. Booyah! <laughs> yeah. Go get him, Star-Lord. You can do it. I am Star Lord. Freaking cosplayers. Would you not get enough love from your daddy, huh? Hey, so what the hell are you saying about cosplayers? Man? I was just saying that they're the best. You got a people. problem with cosplayers? Yeah, and I'm gonna go find it right now. <laughs> Hand colored. They're watercolor. Hand colored. Oh, you were doing it? I'm sorry. <laughs> There's a lot of cool stuff here at this show. Patience is a virtue, and here I am with Louise Simonson and Walter Simonson. <laughs> and I have to say, you are one of my favorite all time childhood artists ever since your days on Manhunter. And, uh, Everything Thank else, you. and uh, obviously Thor, and, and I could go on, but how you doing? I'm doing fine. I'm tired. It's the end of the show. We're kind of beat, but we're happy to be here. So uh, are you working on anything new? I am. It's my shirt. I'm doing a book called Ragnarok. It is my, I've gone back to the Norse myths for the first time in 30 years. I'm doing my own version, and this is what Thor looks like now. So in my, in my story. So I'm doing it through IEW. It's coming out right now bi-monthly. The last of six issues is about to come out. Hey, all kidding aside, you look fantastic. But what are you here for and who are you with? We're here um, with Superheroes Unlimited. We make custom costumes and props and anything you want. If you take a picture, we'll make it. Thank you so much. And where can we reach you at? superheroesunlimited.com or by Facebook, we're under Superheroes Unlimited. Awesome, thanks. Thank you. Here we are with artist extraordinaire Craig Blake. I said Craig Blake. 
It's fine. It's fine. How's it going, y'all? It's me, Old School here, kicking it at the Garden State Comic Fest. If you live in Jersey, you need to come to Garden State Comic Fest. This is the comic show. We have all the biggest name artists in the industry here. We've got cosplayers. We've got the books, man. Garden State. And also, too, uh, check me out online. Old School. Out of Old School. Shameless plug. All right. The helmet on? Okay, he wants to... Uh... <laughs> and when the odds are against him and there's dangerous work, you bet your life speed racer will see it through. Ba, 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 go speed racer. All right. Go speed racer. Where's that big old speed racer pose? Yeah, there you go. <laughs> Almost impossible to do. <laughs> I have to ask you about the artistic process. Do you usually start with a sketch? Uh, I always start with a sketch. Generally a, a very quick thumbnail, roughing out, small, like this, roughing out the composition. And then if once I land on a, on a right setup that I like, then I'll do a more detailed sketch. And once I, you know, that gets more defined, then I'll get models, whatever I need to pose, and I'll take photographs of models, then gather all the props or information or reference, reference material I need, and I'll do a final drawing, and then from that, I then go move to the painting. Well, you have actually uh, used some of my childhood friends as your models over the years, and uh, this is just such a thrill to finally meet you. Yeah. And uh, you're a Jersey boy, just like me, right? Well, I was born and raised in Detroit, but in a sense, I am a Jersey boy because I've been living in New Jersey since 1964. Wow. So in a sense, I'm, you know what I mean? I have more Jersey than Michigan now. But it's nice to have a local show now here in Morristown. Oh, this is the first, uh, real first comic show I've ever been to in uh, Jersey. Well, I hope so, they uh, have more of them, right? Me too. It's really great. I mean, it's just been beautiful. Great experience. Well, thanks so much, sir. Here we are with one of my all-time favorites, Alex Savia. And there you are. How you doing, sir? Uh, well, I'm pretty tired. I'm still recuperating from a massive deadline that, it, that just ended. and uh, But I'm having a great time here at the show in New Jersey, meeting up with old friends and making some new friends, too. Guys, stop licking Clayface. Yeah, this isn't caramel popcorn, mm, guys. so tasty. <laughs> so good. Mm -hmm. It's time for the costume contest. Grace, right here. Grace, right here. Look at mommy. Perfect, just like that. Look at mommy, Grace. <laughs> yeah, that didn't quite work. Already? Right. We got it. I got to tell you, Garden State, I got to tell you. I've done a lot of shows, I've played a lot of stages, and every city I'm at, everyone thinks that they're number one. But I know, coming down to Jersey, you guys do not hold back. I know you people in Jersey are not going to let a little town like, oh, I don't know, Providence, Rhode Island show you up, are ya? No. I know you guys aren't going to let a little town like Bridgeport, Connecticut show you up, are ya? No. Over here in the kitty cat ears is a cosplay guest. She is part of the group called Suicide Girls. Please, a warm round of applause for Lua Suicide! <laughs> Welcome and show some love for the world famous and wonderful and lovely and talented Bill Sher! What? Nick, I always pronounce her name wrong. <laughs> I practice all day. Mikami! I love Deadpool characters. Deadpool the blockhead, I don't know. Oh, the Funko, yes, yes. Let's hear it for the Funko version of Deadpool. Oh no. <laughs> Come on up, play face. <laughs> Show the judges. <laughs> oh, I just got that. <laughs> All right. Turn around and show the crowd. Yeah! Woo-hoo! Black Hammock! 
has played face. Let's do some jumping jacks now for extra bonus points. There you go. Don't, don't, don't listen to those. <laughs> Nova! Woo -hoo. Fantastic. Show the crowd to the judges. Nova! So, Sapphire, just so that people don't call you Chino, why don't you tell everyone who you are? I'm Gamora, the deadliest woman in the galaxy. Let's hear from Gamora from the Comics version of Guardians of the Galaxy! Leonardo, the Ninja Turtle! How can a Ninja Turtle give me a finger? How is that? Vince Morrow as Fiddlesticks, bouncing around, as Harley Quinn. Yeah! Woo -hoo. Harley, where's your pudding? At home? A slacker. <laughs> Who knew Joker was a slacker? With her stars and stripes fighting for your rights, people. Let's show some love for Wonder Woman! Yeah! Look at her out. Oh, watch out. Watch out. Yeah! Get her out of the spider, man. Does whatever I do a spider can at such show up on time. You were lit. <laughs> Let's hear it for Spider Man! <laughs> What's my power level? My oh, Look at that. Oh. That is... <laughs> I'm not quite sure why that shaped like that. <laughs> Katie Coconan as... Dr. Strange! Look at the details of her costume. Look at her fingers! Correct Dr. Strange posing. Authenticity at its highest right here. Yeah! Let's see if I get it right, let's see it for it. Savage Dragon! Yeah! Savage Dragon, look at that. Show the judges, show the crowd, show them all. Let's hear Savage Dragon! Are we up for individuals, everybody? Lewis, Michael, Alejandro, Michael, Amir, also known as the Spider Rush! I say that because I don't remember the lyrics there. We are Comic Con Sunday passes and a pair of 2016 Garden State Comic Fest two day passes. Let's hear it for Diana herself. Wonder Woman! Clayface! Clayface wins $50 in cash, a pair of 2015 New York Comic Con Sunday passes, and a pair of 2016 Guard State Comic Fest two-day passes. Let's hear it for Clayface! Yeah. Take your time, take your time. Oh wow. I don't know how you got Batman with that speed, man. Come on. Clayface!
the group category winners, they win a set of 2016 Garden State Comic Con passes. Let's hear it for the Zelda group, the winners. Yeah, big one. The winners in the best in show, Mad Max Fury! Congratulations on your judge's choice victory. Winners. They want you. Congratulations. I'm good. We're good. We're good. We're good. Here we are with Best in Show. How'd you guys come up with this? Saw the movie, loved it, fell in love with it, awesome. and uh, I'm a big Mad Max fan myself, so... But the arm, how'd that come about? Uh, a lot of trips to AutoZone and Home Depot. AutoZone and Home Depot. Yeah. So it's a little bit of cosplay combined with good old-fashioned mechanics. Oh yeah, oh yeah. And you almost died making that? Yeah, I almost blew up with the gas charge compressed lift. There's a compressed gas in there, so when you try to hit it with a pickaxe, it tends to explode compressed gas. You're a true artist, thank you. <laughs> Well, this was one hell of a weekend, guys. And here we are with Dave O'Hare, Salazar Zola, the two organizers, promoters, of uh, geniuses that put this show together. How are you guys doing? Exhausted. Wiped out, running on fumes. But highly, highly happy. It, it was such a great show, and we want to thank everybody for coming out. Uh, from the vendors to the artists to the cosplayers, everything worked out great. Right, and don't forget the fans. All the fans who the came fans. out, incredible. I this think was this wild. was a real, I would say home run, but I'd say it was more of a grand slam. We've Absolutely. gone be beyond our expectations. Yep, it had everything. You had artists, cosplayers, um, vendors. Uh, it, was, it was awesome, and I hope you guys do it again. We are. Thank you, definitely. Actually, stay we were tuned. Very encouraged. Our dates are coming very soon. Oh, I'll just oh, what a waste. On the lizard? Yeah, I missed that one. Where's Bat Dave and Buster? Buster, I promise to take you to Garden State Comic Fest next summer. Okay, buddy? So just hang in there.